Hello, nerds. You're up close and personal with the wife right here on Four Nerds Gaming. I think I think that was probably about the most cheesy intro I could have done, right? <laughs> so, um, I was playing around in my mine shaft, and I'm coming up out of my mine shaft, and I find this. Do you know what this is? This is sand. Somebody blocked me in. So, I'm going to dig my way out of this and see if I can figure out who did this. It's orange sand. I'm not sure if the color of the sand is going to be any indication as to who the prankster is, but um, generally speaking, orange is Keelan's color. So, I'm not making any accusations yet. I'm not. I'm really not. But we're going to see who did this. So, it's going to take me a minute. So, this might be a, a good time for a fast forward. Either that or a uh, skip around. Either way, I'm going to keep digging. And I'll see you back here in just a sec. This is amazing. Somebody put a lot of hard work into this. shovel <sighs> let's see if I have any iron to actually make a shovel with iron it might go a little faster ooh diamond that'll work diamond shovel for the wifey go a little bit faster and while I'm at it, here we go, I'm going to get some stuff out of my pockets. I am, however, going to leave all of this sand because I really want to know exactly how much sand this person used to prank me because this is an incredible amount so far. Looky here, so far we have four stacks plus seven. And we're obviously still going. All right, back to digging. Be back in a second. Surely that's not part of the prank. Surely that's just something that I missed. Ah, oh, this lag. Oh, 
Lag is from really <laughs> all the way up to my garden. They did this. Hi. I kind of wonder if this was happy getting back at me for the blue <laughs> or the pink. Surely not. I've already spoken with happy today. I seriously don't think that this is happy's handiwork. Whatever it is, sure did put a lot of work into this. Are you, are you kidding me? Really? Oh my, oh. So, uh, apparently not only have I been covered in sand, but I've also apparently been completely blocked in with clay. That's what it appears. Wait, there's light. There's sunlight. There's sunlight. So maybe not. Maybe I have not been completely blocked. Yes, I have. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, they even matched the colors too. That's so awesome. <laughs> Somebody worked really, really, really hard on this prank. And so when I find out who it is, of course, you're going to get it, but um, I got to give you props for this because this is pretty freaking cool. <laughs> All right, get my pickaxe. Okay, so we are now up to, whoops, um, almost, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, almost eight stacks of, oh, hush. Who asked you? Almost eight stacks of um, sand here. Oh my gosh, I can't believe this. This is great. Hello, night sky. Was that one too hard to do? <laughs> they worked really hard. They covered up my wheat and everything. They worked hard. I have to give them a lot of credit for this. They worked really, really hard for this. So I'm really looking forward to finding out who this is. Who did this? Oh, whoops. Oh, I fell on the thing. Oh, my. My friend Ginger would say. <laughs> Hello, Jambé. Um, sorry, I can't kill you properly, so here's a... Pick X to the face. I hope you're alright with that. Not? Okay, well, that's alright. We're gonna do it anyway. This is amazing. This is amazing. This took so much work and so much dedication. This this far surpasses what I did to prank Happy Bandit. Okay? This this is just what I did is nowhere close to this in comparison. So this should be interesting. Um, I, if this was happy, then this was um, duly deserved and very appreciated. Oh, hush. Who asked you? Oh, what are you going to do? Hit me with a block? Really? Uh-huh. gonna uncover my plants. I'm not really gonna 
fret too much about this one up here. I'll get this all later. I need to get out my front door so I can go see who did this to me. Who did this? My chest, right? Yeah. Oh, that was a care package that somebody left me. That was the insolent one, I believe, that left that. So somebody really put a lot of work into this. This is incredible. Good lord. You know, I wonder, you know, I gotta wonder how long this, this was planned and how long it took for them to gather all of this clay alone. I mean, the, the sand, it's not quite that hard really because you know there's so much of it here but this clay alone my gosh i mean that's a huge amount of work just to gather it and the fact that they just went to so much trouble to cover everything is just incredible to me all right let's come out here and see if we can figure out You know what? I think I'm just going to leave those sides there because that kind of actually fixed a little problem that I had earlier. So we're just going to go with it. And then I'm going to put that there where it goes. Because I kind of like that there, honestly. Oh, I don't like you, though. I don't like you one bit. You die, spider. You die. Oops, oops, oops. So the rules of the game... The rules of Prank Wars is that you are supposed to leave a note describing who it was. Oh, there's a note right there. And there's, there's these guys. You know what? We're going to come back in here. I'm going to get armed. I'm going to get armed. To have my baby in here. Because diamonds are a girl's best friend. Especially when they're given to you by your husband. All right. Okay, here we go. There is a sign down there. And there are zombies afoot. <laughs> I love how your home blends into the mesa. Happy bandit. You stinker. Wow, and you know... That's hilarious. And that is nothing... I mean, what I did is nothing compared to what Happy did. I mean, he literally... Look at this. My, I have to back up and show you. He literally... He covered my entire house in clay. <laughs> oh, I totally deserve that. 100%. I'm going to love it. That is hilarious. Oh, wow, Happy. That made me smile today. That was a good one. That was a really, really good one. See, he talked to me today. And he, he gave me a heads up that something could, might possibly be afoot. Which we don't usually do for prank wars. But this time he did. And, you know, he said, where would you see it? And, you know, I told him that, you know, where I was. And that I was probably going to go to this other location soon. And um, so apparently he just figured out where I was and just went from there. <laughs> Which is pretty hilarious, if you ask me. That was pretty good, Happy. Thank you so much for that. Ah, quit shooting me, you numbskulls. That was good. So now, okay, now I, I have been pranked. And Happy has been pranked. Oh my gosh, is there more? What is that? What is that? To the wife, please open this package for an important message. Read book first. Okay. The pink wool. <laughs> Go 
ahead and gather it all up because you know y'all know how I feel about pink wool. It's pink and fluffy and soft and awesome. And it's wool and it's pink. To the wife. Oh, you know what? I recently visited your home in the Mesa. I'm amazed at how you so expertly blended it into the surrounding landscape. I decided I could assist you with your look by making a few additions. Hope you enjoy. Love, Happy Bandit. Happy that was awesome and phenomenal. Um, thanks for the shovel, by the way. That would have come in handy had I actually been outside when you did that, but um, I was inside, which I think actually kind of ended up being funnier. <laughs> so, wow, that's awesome. That was absolutely awesome. And I am so, I just, I love it. I love it, love it, love it, love it. I love pranks, people, I really do. I love pranks. And you know, there's a difference between friendly pranking like this. This is friendly pranking. This is what friends do in fun and it's awesome and it's a lot of fun. Wait, what? What? Oh, for Q, oh. Uh-oh. Oh, uh -oh. Uh -oh. he didn't spell his name right. I better fix that. I better fix that. Whoops. Whoops. Does this make me an accessory now? <laughs> okay. Um, that was one I probably wasn't supposed to see. So, um, yeah. I'm going to leave it at that. <laughs> That's awesome. Um, yeah, so I guess uh, now we know what Keelan's next project is going to be. Awesome. All right, guys. That's not what I meant to do. This, however, is what I meant to do. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you so much for joining us. I didn't have my timer going, so this may have run a little short. Um, but that's okay because there's not much left that I can do right now anyway. So next time I will probably take you back down to the mine and we'll have some fun digging some stuff up there and all that fun stuff. So yeah. All right. By the way, I'm going to give a cheap plug right now because guess what? Something awesome and amazing has happened. And that is if you have not been watching my other YouTube show, Seven Bites, you'll be interested to know that we have finally got our website up and running and that site is www.7bites.com. And it's just about cooking and eating healthy. And we gear it towards people that have had bariatric surgery. So if you've had bariatric surgery or you know somebody who has, um, check it out. Pass it on. And all that fun stuff. I'm going to eat a carrot. Whoops. Apparently I'm not. Apparently I'm going to open a chest while I'm attempting to eat a carrot. There we go. Now I can eat a carrot because carrots are good for you and healthy. <laughs> All right, so on that note, peoples, thank you so much for watching. You guys are awesome. I hope you had as much fun watching this episode as I had digging myself out of my house. <laughs> that was awesome, that was the best time. And so now I've got to come up with some good pranks for uh, Keelan and Laura. And, uh, you know, and also some of the other awesome people on this server, like um, the High Llamas, um, RSS, the Insolent One, um, lots and lots of people that should be explained. See, there's, there's one person on here that I remember his name, and I can't say his name because he's underage, but you sweet little 12-year-old darling, you know who you are, darling, and I love you very much. So, on that note, my dears. Now I'm really saying goodbye. <laughs> I love y'all. Hope y'all had a great time because I certainly did. And we will see you next time right here on 4 Nerds Gaming. Hasta luego. Bye-bye.